Yo, 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 welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to add these using Adobe Premiere Elements 2019. So if you're new to the channel, my name's Travis, and I love to film videos of unboxing cool new tech gear that I use for filmmaking. If I learn something new in Adobe Premiere Elements, I'm definitely gonna share it on the channel here. And when I do some DIY projects around the house, usually involving things from Ikea, I often film those too and put them on the channel here. And of course, whenever I go someplace cool, I'm definitely gonna vlog about it. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you head down below and smash that subscribe button. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to add arrows, fingers, circles, things to highlight certain aspects of your video to draw the viewer's attention. These things are really useful, especially when you're filming a tutorial video using software because you can show your user exactly where they need to click and that's gonna help them follow along with your tutorial. Those are the type of videos that I use arrows in the most, are tutorial videos like this one here today. So adding these arrows, fingers, and pointers is actually quite easy. So let's head on into Adobe Premiere Elements 2019 and I will show you how to do it. Now that you have Adobe Premiere Elements opened up, you want to add some media. So head up to the top left hand corner here and click on Files Folders. So head on into your computer and grab the media that you want to work with. So I'm just going to grab some here. Once you have your media loaded, just drag it down to your timeline. And now I'm going to show you my secret to add arrows to your video to highlight things within the video, I use images. <gasps> so you wanna head out on the internet and grab yourself some images. One of the easiest ways to do it is just type what you're looking for, then click on Google Images, head over to Tools, click on Usage Rights, click on Labeled for Reuse, then you wanna click on Color, Transparent, and here you will see a list of arrows that are available for you to use in your videos that are transparent and will work to highlight certain aspects of your video. Once you have your arrows picked out, head back into your project and add those arrows to your project. So I am going to grab my arrow folder and add that to my project as well. So my favorite arrow is this red one here. So I'm gonna drag that down to my timeline and place it above my video. So this overlays it over top. Now, if you've never done this before, you may get a couple warnings that pop up. Uh, they sense it's a transparent background and you just want to click yes, you'd like to use it as transparent background. I have chosen not to see those warnings ever again, so you don't see them here when I select the transparent file. So once you have your arrow on the screen, you can see it's an image, so it's overlaid. You can turn the arrow, you can resize the arrow, and put the arrow wherever you want. So if you're saying something in the video at this point and I wanna highlight something, that's where I would put the arrow. You can also use things like comment. So I'll show you that one here. We'll add the comment one. So here you have a comment bubble. So if I wanted something to pop up because I missed something, I could do that here using the comment bubble as well. Other transparent images that you can also add to your project are a check mark. So if you want a check mark in your video like this one here, you can simply drag it onto your video, click check. Same with the thumbs up. So as you can see, using transparent images allow you to highlight things within your videos, give a quick thumbs up, or even a check of approval. My favorite is the arrow. My second favorite is the check mark. And another one of my favorite go-tos is the thumbs up. 
So there you have it, an easy way to add arrows to your videos using Adobe Premiere Elements 2019. So if you like this video, hit that like button. If you wanna see more videos like this one, head down below and smash that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy out there. Thank you.